important study undertaken by Indian scientists at the government-run Translational Health Science and Technology Institute has found that coronavirus antibodies could be a reason for more severe dengue infections. The study, which is yet to be peer-reviewed, found that COVID antibodies can cross-react with the dengue virus, potentially enhancing dengue infection. In simple words, it means that dengue virus infects cells more easily in presence of antibodies generated after COVID infection or COVID immunization. Dengue, which is a vector-borne disease, has surged by more than 1300% in India since the initial significant outbreak in 1996. Data from the National Center for Vector-Borne Diseases Control shows that in last year, more than 300 people lost their lives due to dengue. According to the analysis by 24 authors of this particular study, antibodies against SARS-CoV-2 displayed cross-reactivity with DENV2, which is one of the four dengue-causing virus serotypes. This study, which was done on animal models, found that these antibodies, whether obtained from natural infection or immunization, had the capacity to boost dengue infection in animal cells. This preprint study is the first to provide evidence that antibodies against SARS-CoV-2 can cross-react with a dengue virus serotype and increase its infection via antibody-dependent enhancement. Over the last few decades, there has been significant evolution in the dengue virus in India. The authors conducted this study with the objective of exploring the impact of COVID-19 given the latest surge in dengue cases. While the study does not measure the clinical outcome in patients with dengue, it shows that the presence of COVID antibodies makes it easier for the dengue virus to infect lab cells. According to experts, what needs to be determined next is whether the mortality rate or the death rate of dengue infection since the pandemic arrived is higher than what existed prior to 2020. These findings mean that we must pay closer attention to the epidemiology of dengue in India.